All right, y'all. So this is one you need to be setting down for. I try to give y'all that warning when it's gonna be a house like that. This is one of them. This one is next level. We are at Pratt Homes. I'm touring some of their brand new stuff that I hadn't been able to see yet. And it's amazing, some of the houses they have. And this one right here definitely is among that list. Let me give you just a quick look. We've got tiny houses, huge modular homes, like the one we're touring. They have, you know, HUD manufactured homes here. They got a little bit of everything. I love our porch comes down through here and goes that way. That goes into the dining area. This goes into the living room. I'll actually step up on there right before we walk in. Let's see, do we have anything over here that we need to take a look at? Just a little bit of a view there, that's great. What about on the back side? Let's see. Whoa! That was crazy. All right, water faucet there. We have our back door here. This is gonna be where the laundry room is. Be perfect for like a garage, back deck, whatever you wanna do. We've got an electric right up there, one there as well. And you definitely can do customization with the colors and everything, so keep that in mind as well. Beautiful. So yeah, that's pretty much how it works. You come here, pick out a model that you love. These are the show models. You kind of customize the, the way you would like yours. It gets ordered, it gets manufactured, and then it gets brought out to you and set up. And then at that point, it's considered home sweet home. Right here, we have another electric outlet and a water faucet. Now I gotta get inside because we got a lot to see, but I did want to give you just a quick look at our porch. Man, can't you imagine out here in the morning with some Joe? Coffee is what I'm talking about. You don't drink. You telling me you don't drink coffee. There's a shirt for that. All right, another electrical outlet. Look, there's that door that goes into the dining area. We're gonna go this way. They're everywhere, you guys. Y'all don't forget to drop a like. I'd appreciate that. It helps out the video. And subscribe if you will. Let's ride. Today's video is sponsored by Cascade Financial. Cascade has specialized in manufactured home loans since 1999. So whether you're looking to finance the home only or the home and land together, Cascade has the right program for you. So here we are on the inside, and this is gonna be very exciting, you guys, look. I'm gonna give you one little quick look. We're gonna make our way over there. Just, just hang tight, okay? You need to be sitting down, trust me. I wanna start off with our living room, give you a good look at our flooring right here. This is some of that very nice LVP. Luxury vinyl plank, ladies and gentlemen. Look at this little fella. Look like Graydon. Over 2,500 square foot in this house. Lots of room, the layout is phenomenal. You're gonna have nine foot ceilings. You're gonna have this beautiful crown molding. Let me go ahead and give you a close up. Look, I can't even reach all the way up there. Uh, you're gonna have these baseboards. This house, extremely nice, okay? What if I come over here, tuck in this corner real quick for you, give you a good shot. Look at that. So this is the Sequoia. And yeah, they changed up a lot of things on this model. Uh, the last the last time that I seen it was, it was the only other end of the lot down there where they got a different house now. But uh, I believe there was like some columns and stuff right here. I'm not exactly sure. But uh, it's just one of the things they've changed. But you're going to see things throughout if you've seen that other tour. It's just cool to see. They've got several models here that they did that where they basically redesigned the model itself and it's cool because a lot of them have the updated stuff that you know i love to see like your quartz countertops your really nice finishes and all that we step over here into the dining area oh now oh sorry about now. <laughs> didn't see you there bud but yeah here's a good look And 
And there's that entryway on the porch. I mean, look at all the windows we have down here on this corner. And this, uh, you got four chairs. You definitely got room for a little bit bigger table if you want to go six chairs or something. Definitely got room for that. Now let's ease into the kitchen. So this is like, it, it really, you know, it separates your living room and your kitchen, but you got these drawers, you got these cabinets. It is a great storage area, great place for decor. I'm thinking put some family pictures on here. You know, or if you have, say you have a big meal here, you could always use it for dishes, desserts, and stuff like that. So there's a lot of things you can do with this area. And maybe there's other things I'm not even thinking about. So y'all drop a comment if you think of, think of something that I didn't mention. But yeah, these tops right here are very nice. I mean, thick. This is some thick quartz. Obviously, just thinking about it, if you was to order this house, which we'll get into a lot of that at the end, if you was to order this house and maybe you went with some cheaper tops, then you could save a lot of money. Now, I'm going to tell you, if I was getting this home, I'd want to have something like this because it's beautiful. But I'm just saying, if you're looking at ways to have a house this nice, built this well, but still, you know, be at the price point that you got to be at, there's ways to make that happen. You need to come see them if you're over this way. And if you do... Please be sure to tell them you watch the videos. That helps me out so much. Thank you. Obviously, you got the same tops over here, and you've got this is nice. You don't see any backsplash on this particular model, but you can see some options that you have that you could have. I guess they didn't want to put one up, so they just had some samples of all these, so you could see kind of some of the different opportunity you have as far as your backsplash. Let me get close up there. Look at all the options on this thing. Some storage there below. Now we're over here at the I have seen this. Somebody I know, maybe one of my friends or family members, I think my maybe my parents have this refrigerator. That's maybe that's what it is. I've seen this refrigerator before. Here's a good look at our floor plan. So yeah, we got one, two, we got three different sections right here, over 2,500 square foot. You got the coffee station right here. You got some cabinets above that. You have, y'all ready? You got the pantry. <laughs> yes, walk-in pantry, and I love it. I love the corner pantry. It's it's one of my favorites. Um, You kind of know when you see one that you need to go ahead and cue the music because it's going to be walk-in. But look, it's in a perfect location, and there's no wasted space. Like sometimes... You know, you have wasted space in your kitchen, not here. This is used as a pantry where you can store a lot of stuff, and it's great. Huge fan of that, honestly. I don't think there's a better setup for a pantry than the corner pantry. Well, all the bedrooms are down here. Let's get this direction and start checking them out. Come down this hall. First up to our left is gonna be our utility room. Now I remember that. That's where the back door is. You come in here, you've got your furnace there. You've got, uh, look at this, lots of cabinets. Got this area, be great, like folding station, or to have some clothes that you wanna set out maybe for the next day. Stuff that needs to dry, cabinets, drawers. What is this, gonna be your water heater or a storage closet? Water heater, okay. and then access to the attic there. But then right here is a great area for some storage. 
I mean, you could have a freezer. You could even put you some shelves over here, some more cabinets. You could do a lot of things. Breaker box and then on the side of this wall, washer and dryer. We got our main bedroom there. Now, yeah, I know I got to come back to that. I want to go ahead and take you down through here, show you. Oh, my goodness. Look at this bath. Looks like color and grading. I'm telling you, all these pictures look like my kids. I mean, I don't really look like them, but I'm just thinking of, you know, somewhat maybe a five-year-old and a little, a little baby. That's exactly what I got going on. And color loves toys. And man, I love these tops. I've seen these in some site built homes actually, but check that out. It comes all the way across here and you have that drops down. I like that. What is this? Oh, it's gonna be a water closet, isn't it? Now we're gonna start looking at some bedrooms finally. Let's go right here. Okay, here's that kid room. Uh, Bub may, must be out here in the light. That's why it's going to seem a little bit darker. Plus, it's an uh, uh, overcast day, so that's why it seems so dark in here. But, yeah, man, this would be a great playroom. You got the carpet. A little man cave. All right, we got some light here in the closet. So Pratt Homes, they have a little bit of everything here. I know I've talked about it in some of the other tours, but I'm telling y'all, they I love coming to this place because everything's very nice, but they have the tiny houses and they have the huge houses and they got everything in between. And I'm not making that up. I, I seriously cannot stress that enough. If you've never been here and you're over this way or you're wanting to move over this way, you've got to check them out. You've got to. In my opinion, now it's just my opinion, I think you'd be doing yourself a disservice if you was in the market for a home and you was over this way and you at least hadn't been by. Never seen these racks before. And yes, this is your guest bedroom. Out of there. Now, I did notice right here when I was walking, we got us a nice storage closet. So they went carpet in the bedrooms and they continue with this very nice LVP right down through here. You got your baseboards, everything looks great. The crown molding, nine foot ceilings. Uh, I'm, not gonna, I'm not gonna mention it again. <laughs> I've said it multiple times, but it's beautiful. Now into the main bedroom. Woo wee! Y'all see what I'm saying? Oh my goodness. This looks like, man, this looks like some king stuff right here. Okay. Let's check out our clothes, see if I can get a light on for you. There you go. So they got a lot of trim out supplies and stuff. Eventually, this show model right here will be sold and will be delivered. Some Somebody will own this home. I don't know. I would imagine a house like this, the amount of uh, money that's been spent to have this show model set up, they'll probably keep it here a few years, I would imagine. We got one more thing to do. Hey, y'all do stick around after the tour. I'm going to get into some information on this house as always. All right, this shower, never seen the shower like this, and I'm trying to figure out how to go in here. Okay, I just, I'm just i just going to show it to y'all. Look at this. Look at that. Look at that. We got two sinks, so here's the, here's the first one, okay? We've got uh, some nice light fixtures there, and then over this way, let me give you a good shot and shut this door. 
we've got another sink. And then we have this tub. Okay, I'm, I'm, I'm getting ahead of myself again. We got So we got this same uh, quartz in here, okay, that we've seen throughout the house. And then plus we have it here on this tub. Now, once again, you're gonna have a good bit of money in this home in these tops. I'm just saying that this stuff's ex it's expensive. It's just, it is what it is. So you could potentially save a good bit by not having that. And I'm gonna say it once again, <laughs> I would definitely want it. I'm just, I'm just trying to help you out, maybe give you some things to think about that maybe you haven't thought about before. Back over here, but this tile shower, you, you can't, you really can't mess with this, okay? You, it's almost like you have to get this. <laughs> I love it. Look, y'all, I've toured so many houses, but I can tell you, as soon as I seen this shower, it's just like, I know this is a Franklin shower. I could just tell by the way everything is customized. Everything is very nice. You got the rock in the bottom. You're going to have the tiled bench. You're going to have some design up here. You're going to have it down on the bench area. And then, look, we have a little window over here. We walk in. And it makes your voice sound so good. <laughs> okay. Hey, you cut that out, okay? Look at that. It's like a copper shower head. Huge shower and tub in this in this bath. A lot of times these days, it seems like a lot of the houses are Toriel, just to be honest. They'll have a really nice shower, but then they won't have a tub. And I mean, I get it. I get it. I like it still. I mean, I just would like a shower, but this right here has it all. And then you've got this quartz wrapped around it. You're not going to see anything nice is what I'm trying to get around to tell you. And then a great size water closet. So y'all do me a favor, drop a like if you haven't. I would really appreciate that. Uh, don't forget to subscribe and share this video with someone. I would also really appreciate it. I'm gonna give you some information that'll be very resourceful for you. Let's do that right now. So let's get into the outro. Did you see that? Wait, there's like a deer or something in the in my backyard. <laughs> I'm just kidding. This is a wallpaper. I seen a comment the other day. This is just a wallpaper I got on Amazon. And this is a, so this is a fake little, Stick man in a fake. <laughs> I, I, I put these this wallpaper up because I was like, man, I can get a different one every few months and change it out. <laughs> that was been up for about two years. So, hey, sorry. Anybody else like that? Terrible at uh, putting stuff off. Or no, I'm really good at putting stuff off. Okay, so this house is actually manufactured by Franklin. I wanted to share that because the last time I toured this model, it was by a different manufacturer a few years ago at Pratt Homes. And what they do is they'll, a lot of their homes there, especially their high-end modular stuff like this, is going to be custom-built stuff. Not saying that the manufacturer can't build it for you in a different state or, or a different area, but just this is stuff you're typically not going to find on like Franklin's website, for instance. I hope that makes sense. Uh, drop a comment if you need, if you have a question or something like that. But yeah, it's called Sequoia, and yeah, I mean, it's it's loaded. It's loaded to the max. It's got everything. It even has the corner pantry. I mean, when it's got the corner pantry on top of everything else that this home has, you need to buy it. If you don't buy it because it's huge and it's got a big porch and it's got beautiful countertops and cabinets and tall ceilings and all that, and a tile shower that's amazing, buy it because it's got a pantry. <laughs> all right. Information will be in the description. They'll help you out a lot there. This is at Pratt Homes. You can check them out online at lpratthomes.com as well. See all the different modular homes. I've toured a lot of them uh, over the years and just on this last trip. So scroll back on the videos if you want to see some more of their homes as well. I know it's been a long tour, so just want to tell you that and we'll get straight into estimated retail pricing. Now, what I just said about um, customization and stuff. Pricing on this home, especially on a YouTube tour, is very difficult because I don't know exactly where you're at. I don't know uh, your county state fees 
and codes that has, home has to be built to, the options you're going with, you know, and all those different things. So it's just gonna be general estimated pricing for you. So just keep that in mind. This will be for at the time of recording. And I wanna also, I see a lot of times in the comments, now Pratt Homes and most of these retailers that I go to, you know, they're gonna be able to handle a lot of your things as far as like, um, you know, set up obviously, you know, peers that the home has to be. A lot of this stuff is figured in when it comes to pricing. And every deal can be different, but I, a lot of times I see a comment, and I'll put a price, and they're like, then you gotta factor in uh, septic water power, peers, and all this other stuff. And a lot of times all that stuff's already included, okay? So I hope that makes sense. This will give you a great idea, but I do wanna stress, every situation is a little different depending on what you need and what you have, okay? But here you go for at the time of recording. I'm gonna head out. I just put a video out on the second channel yesterday, Chances uh, Collier's Home World, link's in the description. I try to put homes on there that are really, they really hit that affordable price point. If you're looking for something on the lower end, check out that video, check out that channel, and then we'll, the next video on here will be Thursday night, 645 Central Time. Y'all continue to have a wonderful day, and if your day, let's be honest, just ain't been that great. Hey, it's not over yet. Step back. Slow down, take a deep breath, relax, be grateful, be positive, and be thankful. And I believe, I have to do that a lot. I think that'll help you. I'll see you right back here real soon. See ya.